uh, Gatorade bars, and this year we're finally going to be able to give a $1,000 scholarship to a football player. And we're going to continue to do this every year for our seniors. And there's requirements. You have to have a certain GPA, you have to be involved in certain community things. Obviously, you're doing the right things on the football field in the classroom, all right? And at the end of your senior year, when we do the scholarship information, you'll see me, I'll call the seniors down, and you're able to apply for the scholarship. And then three of the guidance counselors, I'm not involved, I give it to them, there's no names on it, and they will pick the winner, okay? I don't want to be getting yelled at that I was uh, biased, biased on that, yeah. so. But this year, I, it was awesome. We actually had co-winners this year for the first time. Uh, everybody knows Izzy Armand, let's give him a hand. Joe Warrick, here we go, give him a hand. And to do the presentation, this is Mr. Reinheimer, he's the president of the Gridiron Club. We have some other members of the Gridiron Club that he will introduce, but hopefully down the road, one of you guys, all right, or ladies will be here receiving this award in the years to come. So make sure you're doing the right things. Mr. Reinheimer, go ahead. Gentlemen, you're used to seeing me here all the time, and most of the time, Mr. Armand. There are several people that got together for the purpose of you guys to make sure their West Ath football players had the most opportunities that you could get in life, after football, uh, during football. That's where all these shirts and everything comes from for rewarding you for all your hard work. That, that was our goal coming into this, to make sure West football players got as many opportunities as possible. So the people you're used to seeing is me and of course, D. Armand, who you all know, he's our vice president. Uh, Bob Miller, uh, who's not here, Joanna McHugh, Tara Bray, and uh, Lori Ewing. All these people share the same interest for you. That's to, so I always tell you guys at football too what your, your game's about. My, my job and our job is to reach out to the community and get the support for you guys. And that's what we did. So every year, these folks, and some may be leaving, some we don't know yet, but these people put it all together. You see me come here and hand you shirts and everything. That, that's the fun part. Uh, but these guys all go to bat for you guys, and you don't get to see them. So... Uh, you just remember that in the back of your minds that they're here for you to make sure you get community support and every opportunity because opportunities are huge so uh one of the businesses i want to make sure that is certainly noted for this because it was very important for them many of your local businesses through pocono pines to uh, blakesley to toby hannah support the west football program one of the businesses that was very specific in making sure that monies went to your scholarship was uh, Bob Bossett of uh, Century 21 Real Estate in Pocono Pines. Uh, Mr. Bossett donated quite a bit to our program and to a certain amount to these scholarships. The other one was yours truly. Uh, very important for us, again, to make sure you guys continue to move forward. This program is huge now. It's get, you guys are getting there, you look great. Enough of me talking. Joel Work, here's your big check. Good luck to you guys. Joel and Easy, let's get you right here. Let's get a picture with the team. That's what it's all about, team. Parents, you want to take some pictures, guys? Get in close there. Thank 